Hi, Steve Axtell here. I'm on the Board of Advisors for the Vint Haven Museum. And we are in the W.S. Burger Building here on the grounds of the museum. And I am going to focus my attention on Arthur. Arthur is an amazing figure that was built for Mark Wade in 1976 by Don Bryan, a figure maker in Canada and also a ventriloquist, a great performer. He has an incredible style to his face, a very exaggerated face, one that does not fit the classic uh, Vint boy dummy. And this figure um, is special to me because uh, Mark was, when I first came into ventriloquism, I was a, a puppet maker and ventriloquists were buying my puppets and using them in their ventriloquism, but I wasn't familiar with the whole ventriloquism community. And Mark Wade told me about the uh, museum and about the convention and he said you'd really do well if you came to the convention and showed them your uh, puppets and, and uh, got to know the people and but you're gonna want to learn ventriloquism because I was just a puppeteer behind the puppet stage and doing my magic so Mark introduced me to ventriloquism in 1986 I came to my first convention uh, with my magic drawing board which is a, a stock item that all the ventriloquists have and use. And it was my first introduction to the community of ventriloquism and to the museum. Very special for me that Arthur was uh, donated by Mark because the pictures that I saw of Mark were, were this picture here where he had Arthur. Now Mark has really um, been a, a really great mentor to me. I learned ventriloquism, um, I was introduced to the museum, Mark met with me as a, as a young man uh, at a mall one time and, uh, and talked to me about figure making and, and what people are interested in and how to price things and he gave me a real idea of the world of, of ventriloquists and just how awesome they are. And so Mark's very special to me, the fact that Arthur is here is very special to me and um, Arthur looks like the photographer of the Vent Haven convention at the time who was Artie Frieda. And Artie um, looked very much like, this is a caricature of Artie, but he had a very large nose, very Jimmy Durante kind of a guy. And he was the photographer and it cracked me up because Arthur's figure was a very uh, little boy looking figure, very much like Mark Wade looks himself. And I thought Artie's figure looks like Mark and Mark's figure looks like Artie. And it, is just serendipitous that his name is Arthur. Artie, Arthur, unbelievable. Now Mark was telling me that he was actually named from Arthur from Mad Magazine. That's where he got the name, not from Artie Frieda. So this is an incredible figure, great design, means the world to me to see him here in the museum. Represents to me all the great feelings of Mark Wade and what he's done for the ventriloquist community. And we're just thrilled to be here in the W.S. Burger Building at Ben Haven Museum. Mm -hmm.